It was two years ago, nine-year-old Savannah took a break from riding horses to go ride go-karts with her family. And in the blink of an eye, her life changed forever. Riding go-karts here on her family's Lewisburg property was nothing new for Savannah, but this time, something went terribly wrong. We were outside, we heard her scream, and I went to her and tried to get her up off the go-kart, and um, she was stuck on the go-kart, so I had to um, come in and get scissors and literally cut her off the go-kart. At that moment, mom didn't realize just how traumatic this injury was. A third of Savannah's scalp had been torn away. When we were in the ER, they told us that it should have been fatal. They didn't know why she had not died from blood loss or from with the depressed fractured skull. It's been a long road, but seven surgeries later, Savannah has proven everyone wrong. What made you so strong? I just kind of stuck with it and believed in myself and yeah. No brain damage, no damage to her spine. Even doctors say they were amazed. She's worn a lot of hats to cover the scars and she's having hair transplants but she made it. She's back home now and doing everything she loves, like playing with all her pets, the ones outside and the ones inside. Uh, this is Squirt. But the biggest hurdle for Savannah was being strong enough to ride her horse again. That was her dream through all of this. And while it's making mom nervous, Savannah has conquered that too. Never think you're not going to make it and stay through it and be tough. She's an amazing little girl. She truly is. She has a, um, a big heart and a strong, strong willed. And I think that got her through a lot. She's just a little miracle. As we said, Savannah seemed to beat the odds, and her mom isn't the only one impressed with her determination. You may have seen Savannah on these Children's Mercy billboards around the city. Her surgeons chose her for this honor based on her positive attitude all through recovery.